Well, people have already started to pack Zilker Park for the festival. And Kexan's Jacqueline Powell is downtown where the city is working to make things easier for people traveling there and just passing through the area. Jacqueline. Sydney, Robert, it's very chaotic out here. You can see behind me a lot of traffic. It's cleared out a little bit as people are starting to go into the festival, but we've seen a lot of people walking, riding scooters along here. It took my photographer and I uh, more than an hour earlier just to get through all of this and get to somewhere where we could park and do this live shot because it is so busy. But Austin's Transportation Department, APD, and Parks and Rec are all working together to try and ease some of the congestion the best that they can out here. Uh, there are shuttles going back and forth. You'll find people directing traffic at every turn and the city's also working with dockless scooter companies to make it very easy to ride a scooter to the festival and drop it off in a designated lot but it won't be as easy to leave tonight when the shows are wrapping up uh, people won't be able to use scooters then so that means a lot larger of a crowd will all be trying to use shuttles or ride shares all at once at six we're going to explain why the city decided it would be best to take all scooters out of the area to where people can't ride them after dark Sydney. All right, Jacqueline, we heard you directing people, so you're doing a good job out there yourself. Jacqueline, thank you. There